Hello dear subscribers, today you will join me on exciting journey to the Grand Sirenis Resort in Riviera Maya. This time we are staying here for two weeks, ready to have a great time. So let's start our tour right at the entrance of this resort. As you can see, there is a big sign saying Grand Sirenis Riviera Maya, right at the front, with a gate for buses and cars to pass through. Now as we get closer, you can start to see the amazing architecture. To me it looks a bit like a Mayan pyramids, don't you think? And there is a palm trees all around, making everything look so pretty and the ground is covered with neat tiles. As we move closer, we can spot some fountains. It feels like a little oasis in the middle of nowhere. It's really hot here, but the water makes it feel nice and cool. We can see that mini buses are arriving all the time, dropping people off. When we approach, we notice that there are two entrances. The first one is for special guests who bought special packages and the second one is the main entrance for everyone else. Here there are cars where the staff helps carry your luggage. Overall everything looks very impressive and promising. The staff at the hotel, especially at the entrance, are very friendly and always try their best to help. Now we are getting closer to the lobby. The lobby is amazing, it's all shiny, with tiles everywhere and there is so much space, it's really impressive. The ceilings are very high and we are actually on the second floor here, you will see more of that soon. The lobby and reception are together, right next to the entrance to the buffet restaurant. Now as we move forward, we are going down the stairs into a huge hall on the first floor. There are comfy seats all around where people can sit and relax. There are also tour operators nearby in case you want to book a tour. The ceilings are really tall, making everything feel very fancy. And there is even a palm tree right there. You can also spot a small shop at the far end. As I mentioned, the tour operators are sitting around here. There is also a lobby bar with friendly bartenders who can make delicious drinks and serve quality cocktails, so don't hesitate to order something nice. When I filmed this video it was still morning, so yes, what you are seeing here in the morning time. As you can see in the lobby people are probably walking around after breakfast, just relaxing and thinking about what to do next. The day is just getting started and families with kids are everywhere. This is definitely a family friendly hotel. There is so much greenery around, it feels like you are in the middle of the jungle. If you look to the right or left, it's all just jungle. Right in front of the lobby there is a theater where you can watch different shows in the evening. There is a lot of performances to enjoy. Look at the outside of the hotel. It's all glass and high ceilings, which makes everything feel really fancy and special. The theater has a lot of space and at the far end there is a bar where you can get drinks before, after or even during the show. During the day the performers are practicing so they can put on a great show for you in the evening. In the lobby there are long hallways with different services for guests, including some special areas for VIP clients. Everything looks very nice and there are even a bathroom along the way, plus painting on the walls. Uh, the hallways are big and beautifully decorated. You can walk from the central lobby and easily head outside if you want. There is a plenty of space for everyone with lots of bathrooms and areas to relax. The hotel is huge, made up of two large complexes for guests. Here for example is the stage and you can see the staff moving things around. The paintings have interesting themes which adds to the nice atmosphere. 
Now let's check out the Sirene Sports Bar. It's a place where you can hang out during the day, morning or evening. You can play pool, watch sports on TV or enjoy a tasty cocktail. The staff here are very friendly and always ready to help. For instance, I just ordered a cocktail and the bartender made it super fast, showing great skills. People are playing pool and it's a fun place to be. The drink he made was delicious, thank you for that. Now let's keep going and see more of the resort. You can also see the map of the resort here and if you want you can pause the video to check it out. The map shows where everything is located. Now we are heading to the other side of the resort. It's surrounded by trees where people can walk and enjoy the scenery. The bridge is covered with stones and everything is done so nicely. From the landscaping to the roofs that give us a cool look. It all feels very authentic and pretty. Connecting the two parts of the hotel. It looks especially beautiful in the evening. You will see more of that later in the video. As we walk, let me share a few fun facts about the place. Here are some fun facts about the Grand Sirenis Resort. Surrounded by jungle, the resort is located right in the middle of tropical jungle, so you might spot some exotic animals like iguanas and kuatis. Guests love the feeling of being in real nature oasis. Ancient Mayan ruins. There are actual Mayan ruins on the resort grounds. This makes exploring the area even more exciting because you get to enjoy both relaxation and a bit of history. Beautiful beaches. The resort has direct access to stunning beaches with crystal clear water. It's perfect for swimming, snorkeling or just building sand castle. Lazy river. There is a lazy river that flows through the resort. You can grab an inflatable tube and float around enjoying the view and relaxing in the water. Eco-friendly practices. The resort takes care of the environment by using eco-friendly practices like recycling programs and conserving energy. It's a great place for those who care about nature. Evening shows. Every night there are live shows in the theater, including dance performances, magic acts and even cultural shows that share a bit of the local history and traditions. These little details make the resort a special place to visit, offering a mix of fun, nature and culture. Now let's quickly explore the second part of the Grand Sirenis Resort. Here people are relaxing on loungers, playing water volleyball and just enjoying the atmosphere. The ground around the pool is concrete, which is great because it stays dry even when there is a lot of water splashing around. This is a buffet restaurant and you can see that some tables are set up outside so you can enjoy your meal in the open air. You can even play some fun games like ping pong here. The buffet itself is very nice with marble details that makes it look elegant. In the evening this area turns into Brazilian steakhouse offering a delicious dining experience. Over here you can see cabanas with comfy cushions where you can relax for free. The pool is huge with plenty of space for everyone to enjoy. There is also a swim bar where you can grab a drink. The nearby buildings have rooms with balconies that offer a beautiful view of the resort. After enjoying a meal at the buffet, guests can head out to the pool and have fun. There are also entertainers who keep everyone active with games and dances. Let's cross this little bridge that goes over the pool. On one side there are jacuzzi area where you can sit with your kids and on the other loungers built right into the water. People are just having a great time.
The Beach Cafe is simply amazing. It has comfortable cozy seating with tables, a bar and snack area where you can grab different treats like freshly made tacos. There is a small line but it moves quickly. And the best part, it's all right by the ocean giving you beautiful view. People are just relaxing and the staff keeps everything clean, so it feels perfect. Stay tuned for more. If you walk a bit further, we reach a spot where you can get both alcoholic and non-alcoholic drinks. There is hardly any line and it's right on the beach, making it the perfect place to refresh yourself on a hot sunny day. Now as we step into the beach, you can see how beautiful it is. The sand is clean and there is a little cove here with stunning greenish blue water. It's surrounded by rocks, but this spot is just perfect for a swim. Behind those rocks, there is a small lagoon where you can and snorkeling and watch the fish. People are strolling around, relaxing and just enjoying their time. The best part is that the beach here is sandy and you can set up your lounge chair right on it. If you go a bit higher up, there are more seating levels, like a second and third tier. It's like being on a small hill, where you can enjoy a great view of the ocean while staying in the shade under the uh, tetched umbrellas. The view is stunning, especially for those who love taking photos. As we walk a bit further, you can see there are lots of people around. It's almost noon, so the sun is hot and it's important to stay in the shade, use sunscreen and keep hydrated. I haven't seen anyone unhappy here. There is even a swing where you can take some fun photos. The staff is always nearby inviting guests to join in activities like volleyball or other games. Just look at these palm trees, the scenery is simply beautiful. If you walk further along the beach, we will come across the kids' pool. This is where the children's club is located and it's a great place for kids to have fun. The pool looks like a lagoon and has lots of interesting features, like fountains, a tipping bucket and various sea creature shaped slides. Now we can head back to the beach and try some delicious sandwiches prepared by professional chefs. These sandwiches are made with large fresh baked roll, cut in half, filled with plenty of meat, tomatoes, cucumbers, various spices and cheese. It's really tasty. At the nearby tables you can also grab burgers or hot dogs and then come here for a slice of this amazing sandwich. After it's prepared, it's cut into portions and I'm sure one piece will be more than enough, so come and give it a try. It's time to welcome the sunrise. The sunrise here is very bright, with the sun rising over the water. Many people come to watch, grabbing lounge chairs and lying down to enjoy the view. Some days there are more people, some days fewer, but it's always romantic, especially for couples looking to share a special moment. It's a truly beautiful on the white sand with the green palm leaves swaying in the breeze. Just look at the sun and the waves gently crashing on the shore. Everything is calm and picturesque. I think it's simply wonderful.
the resort has an interesting future. One section of the complex faces a more exclusive site, reserved for privileged guests with separate pricing for everything. There are private cabanas that are well maintained, offering a unique and secluded atmosphere. It's fascinating to walk around here. The pathways are beautiful and meticulously kept, and it's clear that this area it means for wealthier guests, as the packages with access to this section are quite expensive. Now let's head back and walk along the pathways, maybe even explore one of the buildings. The building is impressive, with lots of glass and marble everywhere. You can see carts being used to deliver towels and equipment for the housekeeping staff, as well as to transport guests around. Let's go upstairs. The stairs are beautiful, with glass sides, and the whole place looks very upscale and luxurious. As we go up, you will notice there are three floors. Everything here is well maintained, with spacious lobby that feels like a castle. There are many rooms and even elevators available. The staff keeps everything clean at all times. Let's head up to the third floor. It's similar to the others with views in both directions. Overall, it's a very nice and well kept area. In addition, I can say that the views from the balconies and walkways between the buildings are stunning. As you walk, you might see birds flying by, and if you look in one direction, you can even spot the ocean and the trees, it's truly beautiful. On the other side, you can see the pool and the central part of the resort. The views are breathtaking and really make an impression. You know what's even more interesting? As you walk around the hotel, there are many walkways and connection areas, which is nice. But on the ground floor, you will be surprised to find the trees and palm trees actually grow right inside the resort. There are special spaces for them, and it's something I haven't seen in any other resort before. It's really cool. Also, the cars are always ready to pick up you and take you whenever you want at your request. Now, let's walk along the buildings and see how everything looks. In my opinion, it's all very beautiful beautiful and impressive. The balconies are stylish, with small palm trees here and there, and it feels like an oasis or even a jungle. On the balconies you can see charming tables and chairs, where people relax and enjoy their time surrounded by greenery. There are even special spots designed for these purposes. Let's explore one more building that we haven't visited yet on this wall. It's located near the pool and some rooms face the more exclusive side. It might be a bit cleaner here or maybe not, but overall everything is very well kept and lush. Now we can head back towards the beach and cross the lazy river again, because it's always a pleasant experience.
The lazy river has crystal clear blue water and usually opens around 9 am after the stuff finishing cleaning. There are plenty of tubes available and there is really a line. People can really unwind here. By noon there will be more gas, but since the river is quite large, there is always enough space for everyone. Now let's head over to the Dolphinarium. It's a bit of a walk, but you can take a shuttle to get there. Once the shuttle drops you off, you will need to walk a little, but it's definitely worth it. You will get to see the dolphins and watch a dolphin show. You can also book a private session and pay to interact with the dolphins just like we did. There is a gift shop right next to the registration area, where you can buy all sorts of interesting items. After signing in, you will get a brief orientation and then you are ready to go. You will have the chance to swim with dolphins, interact with them and even pet them. It's a wonderful experience, highly recommend it. Now let me tell you about the Spied Grand Serenis. It's a large complex located close to the Dolphinarium. If you stand at elevated part of the spa, you can actually see the Dolphinarium from there. I mean, the view from the spa's upper level is truly something special. Surrounding the spa, there are towering trees that seem to arch over the pathway, creating a natural canopy. Walking under them feels surreal. It's stunning, unlike anything I have seen before. The tropical plants around are just mesmerizing. I mean, oh every time I see them. When you move down slightly from the top of the spa, you can even catch glimpses of people relaxing in the outdoor pools. The walkway has this beautiful glass and shirts in the railings, adding a slick modern touch. You will even see cars driving around here. If you stroll nearby, you can spot water flowing from one of the levels down the walls, forming a kind of waterfall effect. It's incredibly beautiful, these colors that perfectly blend with the lush greenery around. If you go up towards the spa, you will find cozy tables where you can relax and unwind before entering the spa itself. It's a lovely spot to take a bracer and soak in the atmosphere. If you step outside the resort's grounds, you will find yourself in a more rugged, untouched area, wild terrain, scattered rocks and the open, untimed sea. Out here you are on your own, but there is a unique beauty in that solitude. In the distance you can even spot the Dolphinarium. We make our way quickly along the beach and cross a small lagoon climbing up to discover a little fortress-like structure, a memorial area located right here just beside the beach. It's such a beautiful day and it feels wonderful to be there.
Afterward, we head back down, passing by cozy cabanas with these roofs and open air spaces where spa treatments and massages are offered, should you desire. The beach itself, as you can see, has plenty of loungers and sitting areas. There is more than enough for everyone, all beautifully decorated. There are numerous massage spots along the edge of the beach as well. You will even find a sink post with different markings showing countries and various other things. Let's take a walk along one of the resort sections. Everyone is relaxing, everything is clean and well maintained. By the way, there is a swim up bar with access from both sides and loungers set right in the pool, so people can find the perfect spot to unwind, whether in the water or on a lounger. Now we are walking alongside a bridge, not over it, and you can see the swim of bar from the other side. There are even areas like mini jacuzzis, and nearby there is a volleyball net set up for friendly game. The area is filled with loungers, making it all very comfortable. Let's dive into this beautiful water and walk along the pool's lens, right under the volleyball net, continuing onward. The water is a vibrant blue, absolutely beautiful. There is space to swim, even practice if you like, enough room for everyone. Now you can see everything up close, including the swim up bar where many people are relaxing. Altogether it's a wonderful place, filled with refreshing water, great atmosphere and everyone is enjoying themselves fully. If you go to watch the sunset, it's truly beautiful, so picturesque. The sun rises, casting its light everywhere, and people come out to enjoy the moment. Now let's take a morning stroll through Grand Sirene. As you can see, the swings are here, and everything is still calm. Most people are still asleep as the sun begins to rise, but nature is already awake, filling the surroundings with vibrant colors. Let's step into the lobby of the first building and see how everything looks in the morning. The sunlight reflects off the polished floors and clean walls, creating a stunning atmosphere. Now let's walk along the pool side. Everything is well kept and pristine. You will also notice groups of coatis wandering around, looking for food. This touch of wildlife adds so much charm. Near another pool, we even spot a giant chess set and a lot of loungers, all ready for guests to relax. The greenery around is indescribably beautiful, absolutely breathtaking. 
In the evening, Grand Sirenis transforms into a different world. The lighting is simply spectacular, with creative, colorful illuminations that make everything look magical. There is a bar set on an elevated area where a live band is always playing. People relax and dance, especially early in the evening when no one is in a rush. You can head to the sports bar to play a game of pool or enjoy a cocktail. As the night progresses, there is a nightly show to enjoy, sometimes it's theatrical performance, other times it's a live band. It's always engaging and full of energy, with the performers giving the all. All around, lights and strings of twinkle girlands create a warm, festive glow. It's a beautiful scene at night, with plenty of cozy spots to sit, stroll, listen to songs and enjoy live music. Now it's time to grab a bite. The selection is huge, even just at the buffet. There is a wide variety of dishes available, with chiefs preparing fresh items on the spot like tacos and various Mexican specialities. There is a wide variety of delicious desserts and plenty of meat dishes too. There is always something to choose from. And everything is so tasty and wonderful. You will be licking your fingers. And after all of this, you can still make it to the nighttime show. On the beach there is a fire show with performers spinning and doing amazing things with flames. Then you can head to the theater where they host musical performances, even featuring acts that mimic famous musicians like Michael Jackson. Afterwards, there is a reception in the lobby with a spread of delicious Mexican dishes to try. Everything is beautifully set up with crystal, marble and touch of elegance everywhere. To wrap things up, Grand Serenis Resorts offers an incredible experience filled with vibrant activities, stunning nature and unforgettable moments. From relaxing at the beautiful spa to enjoying the scenic beach views and lively evening shows, there is truly something here for everyone. The dining options are endless, the atmosphere is captivating, and every corner of the resort is crafted to perfection. If you're looking for a memorable gateway with a blend of relaxation and excitement, Grand Serenis had it all. Thank you for joining me on this too. I hope this gave you a little taste of the magic here. Don't forget to subscribe for more travel experiences and I will see you on the next adventure.